Hey guys, it's Artek here again with another quick video. If you're planning to extend the hard drive memory on your PC, here is a good trick that you can use to get a cheaper HDD upgrade. All you need to do is buy an external desktop HDD from the market, which you will notice that you might get much cheaper than buying an internal hard drive. I would suggest getting a bigger external hard drive because they mostly come with the 7200 RPM premium drives. I have over 70 terabyte of external backup drives at the moment. For my new PC, I specifically got this Seagate 10 terabyte expansion drive, pretty cheap from Amazon Australia. I did a bit of research to confirm it was equipped with 7200 RPM Barracuda Pro drive. I suggest not to get a 5400 RPM drive because it would be really slow. It's a simple process to extract the hard drive from the expansion drive. Just follow the instructions I have shown in this video. This trick works on almost all external hard drives. First step is to open your external drive. Some drives have interlocking enclosures. Some come with screw models. In my case, there are no screws, so I need to open it by using a prying tool. I use the button knife in my case. Just gently insert the prying tool into the gap and start unlocking these interlocks. You will hear a click sound confirming that the lock has opened. Continue working around all the sides of the case until it's all opened. Next, open the top cover and you will see the internal drive tightly packed in the disk enclosure with the adapter circuit board which you need to take out. Don't throw it away as you can use it later if you need to. Carefully extract the hard drive from the enclosure. In my case, I pull the hard drive by using this aluminium kind of safety tape wrapped around the circuit and drive. You could use a screwdriver or some other tool to pull it upwards. I removed the adapter circuit gently. Then I removed these rubber pads to reveal the screws. You can reuse these rubber pads as well. I removed the screws and was able to successfully extract this brand new Barracuda Pro internal hard disk drive ready to be installed on any PC. In my case, I opened my Alienware R11. I plan to install two SATA drives on my PC. So first thing I did was to locate the SATA drive ports on my PC's motherboard. Connected the SATA connector to the motherboard on one side and connected the SATA cable along with the power supply input cable to the SATA drive. Find a safe spot to put your SATA drive into your system. In my case, R11 does have a space for putting extra peripherals. I find this spot at the bottom convenient and safe. Please make sure that your cables are not hindering the case or GPU fans and not touching any part of your motherboard. Secure your hard drive properly into the enclosure. After installing the drive, turn on your PC and check if it has detected your drive. And that's it, you're all done. If you're happy with one partition, that is great. I created two partitions for this drive. And now my Alienware R11 has 14 terabyte of total storage memory, which is great. Once again, thank you for watching this video. If you like the content of this video, please hit thumbs up and please subscribe to my YouTube channel and press the bell icon. Thank you.